Good morning, everyone. Aren't you looking fabulous this morning? <laughs> Hi, I haven't done anything to myself yet, so please don't mind the way that I look. I literally just woke up. I wanted to start the vlog. My refrigerator is just going nuts again. I'm not gonna lie, I don't know how to make the refrigerator stop, so it's just gonna go like that until it quits. <laughs> Anyways, I have a couple things that I wanna do today. Today's gonna be an exciting day. It's Saturday, happy Saturday. And uh, yeah, I'm actually really excited for today. I need to go drop off something that someone ordered from Poshmark. And then I need to go to the tailors because I wanna see if I can get my Ralph Lauren pants either taken in like at the waist or like hemmed up because they're so freaking long. I don't know why they're so long. So if I can do both today, that'd be awesome. I just don't know how much it's gonna cost because I've never went to a tailor before. Um, but if I could just get them like kind of like cinched in, that'd be really, really nice because they're way too big. Um, but yeah, I don't want you to see me looking like this any longer. So I'm going to get ready. <laughs> I'm back and I'm more uh, put together now. So I am officially starting my day and I have a crisp Diet Coke because I don't know, sometimes I just, I just, I'm addicted to Diet Coke and I like Diet Coke sometimes more than coffee, so. Mm. It's like spicy. Not literally, it's not spicy, but it like, you know, it's so carbonated that it like takes your breath away a little bit. Yeah, I love that. So. This is the fit. Very, very simple today. Um, so I have this new hoodie or like crew neck from Mayfair Group and it says empathy on it and I got it in a large. It's so cute. I don't technically have to wear shorts with it, but like I feel like if there is like a breeze, like a gust of wind, then my ass is gonna come flying out. So I did put on some like biker shorts with it. These are from Amazon. And then I just have my Celine sneakers on with uh, some, what are these socks called? They're like trendy um, 80s socks. <laughs> so there's that. And I think for the bag today, I'm gonna go with something a little smaller. I haven't worn my pull-in bag in a quite a long time. So I thought, I figured out how to change the strap. Oh my God, I figured out finally how to adjust the strap. So I have done that now. Look how short she is now compared to how she was before. So she literally goes right under like the right boob. I guess you could do like a, I know Cassie always talks about like a left titty flex, but like I literally never wear my bags on the left side. I don't know why. Do I even know how to put it on on the left this way? Left titty flex right there. Or I could just, you know, wear it as a necklace. I could rock one of these like this. Is that weird? This is what I thought that I'd wear today. I think it'd be cute. My bangs are really dirty and I need to wash my hair. I'll wash it tomorrow because I only wash my hair once a week because my scalp is so dry. So like I don't need to wash it more than once a week, but like I can tell my bangs are, uh, are quite oily. <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna take a couple of cards and my driver's license. Oh, these are the pants, by the way. I meant to show you. Well, let me just do one thing at a time. So I'll put my cards in here. I'm gonna take my car key off and my house key off. I'll just throw that in there. Can I fit my pepper spray in here? I oh, I can fit my pepper spray in here. Well, she's going in there. Hell yeah. Um. What else? What else do I even take with me? I don't really take much. I guess I'll just take. I, ta I guess I'll take some gum. Also, I just. I just don't take much in my bag. I swear. But I think that's pretty much all I need. So I'm glad I just took the mini bag today. And here we go. That's the fit. I think we look super cute. Okay, I gotta go to UPS first. Before I do that, I want to show you the pants that I need to get tailored. I took my mic off because I was about to leave the house, but uh, I'm sorry if the audio is kind of bad now. But um, here they are. I know you've seen these before. I did like a haul and I tried these on, but these are my Ralph Lauren, Polo Ralph Lauren, kind of like dress pants. And I love these pants to literal pieces. 
but they're way too big, so I need to get them taken in at the waist, and they're way too long, so I need to get them hemmed up as well. So I called a tailor in my area, and I thought that it was gonna be like super expensive to get this done. She said that it was only 20 bucks to get the waist taken in and $12 to get it hemmed. I thought it was gonna be like 100 bucks. <laughs> okay, so, okay, so I made it to the alterations place, and I, she's already, well, I don't have my pants back, because I'm not gonna have them back for about a week and a half or so. They're really busy over there, which I'm really glad they are, but um, I'm gonna pick them back up on the 26th, and um, it's so cool because in there, uh, they're Korean. I've never seen anybody that speaks Korean in the area that I'm in. I don't speak Korean. However, I could like immediately tell this was Korean because they have like the uh, radio playing. So at the end, when I walked out, I was like, Kansamida. And the, the, the lady in there, she was like, oh my God, she said, you did a good job. I'm like, no, I didn't. <laughs> But it was really nice. I love the chance to speak any other language whenever I get the chance to. So it was very fun for me. And uh, yeah, so now I am on the way to UPS so I can drop off that package uh, for the person that bought some makeup from my Poshmark. And then I think we're going to go to lunch because I really want to get some sushi. Listen, I want to get the sushi like nigiri. I think that's what it's called where it's just like a piece of rice and like the sushi's on top or like the fish is on top like your salmon or tuna or whatever it is. That is what I want to get. So there is a place over here that does that. So I'm going to go over there. But now I'm going to UPS. Also, it was really quick in there. Um, they're really, really fast, um, but they're just so busy. So they're really backed up. And she was like, well, I, technically I could get it done by next Friday, but it'd be a lot easier if it was like the following Tuesday. And I was like, listen, I, I just want these pants to fit. So I just tell her to take, take as much time as you need and I'll just come back and get them at some other time. So, so I'm gonna come back and get them on the 26th. Yeah. I'm coming to get my nails done now. We're about halfway through, maybe a little more than that. I'm doing, I'm doing the crumb, I'm doing the pearl, it's happening. Okay, I'm done, here it is in natural lighting. I think it looks so cute. Here, hold on. Let me take you over here, or back home because I'm picking up my husband to go eat lunch. So like, okay. So like, here's this bush, <laughs> and then here's what they look like against the bush. I think they look cute. Hold on. I think they look really cute. They look very like bridal, very, I don't know, fancy looking, I guess. But um, the guy did like an off-white base color instead of like a white white, which I told him an off-white just because I thought that's what people did. But he was like, maybe next time do white white. And I was like, yeah, okay. But I still think it looks cute. try the crab rangoon first. It's so good. I've got a couple of spring rolls. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then I got my nigiri on the way and I'm so freaking excited. I got shrimp. No, I didn't. I got salmon and yellowtail. Can't wait. Ooh, she looks so good. So salmon and yellowtail and I've got some wasabi and ginger here. Oh my gosh. That looks so nice. Okay, I'm gonna try this. This is my first time trying sushi like this. Um, which one should I do first? We'll go yeah, with do that the one, yeah. salmon. Okay. Do a little dip a dip. Mm -hmm. like I like it. Uh, yeah. Oh, very good. I knew I would. Yeah, it's very good. Look at that. Stopped in Ulta to get a couple things. I needed to get some brow, um, like a brow pen. Like, not a pencil, but like a pen. Because I used to use these ones called Milani Weekend Brow, and I'm I'm out of it, so I loved it so much. So, But I can't find Milani here anymore, so I got the Anastasi one. And then I got some thickening cream by Bumble and Bumble. We'll try that, or like thickening spray. And then I wanted to try these Florence by Mills little eye patches. They look so cute. So yeah, I want to get these really quick, and then me and Raph are going to Target. Hey, 
Every time I come into Starbucks now, I get this lime frosted coconut bar. This thing is so freaking good. I'm normally not a huge fan of coconut, but these are amazing. Okay, now we're in the Target like main area. We're actually in like the TVs and games section <laughs> right now. I got my, what is this called? It's like an acai lemonade refresher. These are really good. Raph got a caramel, caramel ribbon crunch uh, frappuccino. Those are really good. And I also had that, um, the little cake, the little coconut cake with lime frosting. Oh, it's so good. Raph's like super into collecting video games right now. So mm -hmm. what have you found? I don't know, it looks good. Okay. This is my favorite aisle in pretty much any supermarket. This is our go-to coffee, if anybody's interested. It's very good. And we got the whole bean one. Look at these. They've got like the most beautiful pastel flowers. They're so cute. Okay, hi, I'm back. And I wanted to show you quickly everything we got on our little outing. It's not like I got a ton of stuff or anything like that, but I did pick up a couple of things. So you saw what I got inside of Ulta. Where did... Okay, so in Ulta, I'm just gonna show you again because I don't know if you saw exactly what I got. So I got the Bumble and Bumble Thickening Spray right here. I wanted to try this because I have to wash my hair tomorrow. So I thought I'd try that and then give myself a little blowout. And then I picked up the Anastasia Beverly Hills brow pin right here. And I was going between the shade Chocolate and the shade Ebony because when I was using the Milani Weekend Brow, I used like the shade Espresso. And it was like, um, it was kind of, it was almost black. It was pretty dark. Here's what it looks like out of the packaging. And then it has like a tip like this where you can draw like hair strokes. If you see that? So I really like ones like this. I ran out of my Milani Weekend Brow like a few, about a month ago, and I've been trying to use the Benefit Brow Pencil. It's just not the same. It's not the same. I really like brow pins nowadays. I know Glossier has a one that's, has a one <laughs> that's really popular, but they didn't have Glossier at all, so I got the, so I got the Anastasia ones. Anyways, and then I picked up the Florence by Mills little eye patches little eye masks because i don't know i've been needing to find some new eye masks i thought they were really cute i've used the purple ones before like the ones that look like little whales i've used those here's what the little container looks like she's so cute it's mint it's mint green so it's like my favorite color i love mint so much and these ones are specifically for like de-puffing i guess i don't know oh look they're little flowers can you see that? Oh my God, they're like little flowers. This is the cutest thing I've ever seen. So I'm actually gonna use one of these tonight when I take my makeup off. I'm very excited about it. And then I got these, Ref got these beautiful flowers for me for the house. So I'll definitely be putting these in a little vase uh, here in a moment. But yeah, and then we went to GameStop because Raph loves to go to GameStop like every weekend just to kind of see what's there. And I got my first Squishmallow. <laughs> Listen, Laura DIY come for me because she's obsessed with Squishmallows and I got my first one. She's a little deer. She has her own name, which I can't read because the tag is covering up her name, but I'm gonna name her something else. Leave, leave a comment for a name for her and then we'll give her a name. She's very cute. She's a little deer. She's a little fawn. She's adorable. So yeah, I just thought, this, I just thought she'd be cute on the bed or something. Anyways, also in super good news, while I was getting my nails done, look, look how pretty. Let me see if I can turn the, if you follow me on Instagram, you've already seen my nails. Oh my gosh, look at that. So cool. But yeah, you should totally follow me on Instagram. It's at Kinsey Scarlet right here. And then I post pretty much everything before I do on YouTube because, you know, Instagram is pretty, uh, immediate. I got a call while I was inside getting my nails done and it was from that American Signature Furniture place and a couple videos ago I explained that I was getting my table soon for the living for the dining room. It was supposed to come on the 27th but I got a call and they said we can deliver it early and it will be arriving on the 21st. 
I'm so excited, you guys. We have been waiting for this table since December of last year. December, and now it's July. So December, well, we already knew we were gonna be waiting until March because we pre-ordered the table. So it was originally supposed to ship out in March, but it did not, no, no. And then it's been December, January, February. Why am I counting like that? Gen December, January, February, March, April, May, June, July. Seven months seven months that we've been waiting for this table. We would have only had to wait for three months if it would have shipped out in uh, March like it was supposed to. So we have waited an extra April, June, July, August, an extra four months. I don't think I'm buying anything else from this company uh, in the foreseeable future, but I'm so happy to have the table. I cannot wait. I will 1 million percent show you whenever I get it. It won't be in this vlog, but um, I cannot wait to show you because I did get a table, like a little stand thingy for my laptop. And I really want to get like a smart keyboard and like a trackpad because I want to be able to do work at the table now and the reason why I don't do work at the table already is because the table is glass and I don't know I really hate that because the table is just ugly to begin with so like you know how people do these really like cute aesthetic table like flat lay shots I can't do that with this table because it's already but ugly and it's see-through so all you can see below it is just the floor and I can't wait to get the other table because it's a marble table it's beautiful. It's like a solid piece of marble with like a black stand kind of thing. It's just beautiful and I'll be able to actually do some like really nice aesthetic shots. It's very hot. I'm gonna change and then I think me and Raph are just gonna chill for the rest of the day. Uh, I will keep vlogging but probably nothing else interesting will happen but we'll see. She's going to the bowl. Okay, well, I put them in. I am 100 million percent sure this is not going to work. I just know my hair, it's not going to work. It's just gonna be frizzy. It's probably not even gonna dry properly. I only remembered to do two of them away from my face. Everything else I did towards my face. Uh, so, uh, it's probably gonna be really bad. I did already do my bangs. That was like the first thing that I did because they were like already half dry by the time I figured out how to do this. I know it's not gonna work. I'm gonna try to put some heat on these to see if I can make them dry faster. I just, I don't have high hopes. And like this one's so further up than this one and I don't know how I did that or what happened, but I don't know. It didn't work. <laughs> I knew it wouldn't work. Like I knew it just would not work. My hair does not do very good when it comes to like, I just, I, just, I have to use my Dyson Airwrap for my hair to work, but hey, it's got a lot of volume. I'll give it that. So like what I'll probably do is I'll take out my face framing pieces and maybe I can actually put it into a cute bun. Rav suggested a bun. So since there's so much volume, I look, this looks so stupid. Well, it was a fail, but at least I tried. So now I'm gonna return those to Amazon. <laughs> and then I think me and Raph are just gonna go get Taco Bell. So I, that's what we're gonna do now. All right, this is what I ended up doing with it. I still don't know how I feel about it right now. I think it looks better than, than it did before, but I curled it and I did like, you know, alter like alternating, alternating. So like I would do like one away from my face, one towards my face, the other away from my face, you know? And I think it looks a lot better. It's just, it has so much volume. I had to like uh, tie back a couple of the pieces because they were way, I had, it looked like uh, I was Winona Ryder in Stranger Things. Like it looked like I had like a mushroom right here. It still kind of does, but I don't know. He's not for you guys. I have got the goods and Honestly, when I just go to t 
Taco Bell. Raph got Dunkin' Donuts because he wanted to give one of the bacon, no, sausage, egg, and cheese English muffins. And then and whenever I go to Dunk Taco Bell, uh, I only get the five layer burritos. And then very occasionally, whenever I'm feeling super healthy, I'll get like a one of those power bowls. They're really, really good. I feel like I just look ridiculous with this hair. It's not a good hair time. Hopefully tomorrow it'll be better. Okay, we've come back out now. I mean, we're going back to Target because um, Raph wants to try to get a mini pizza from the Pizza Hut little area that's inside of Target. And then I also am doing a pickup order because since we're getting the table on next Thursday, um, I ordered some marble coasters. So I'm gonna go pick those up. All right, we're back home and we are watching Supernatural. Raph is having his ice cream. Oh, you were having your ice cream. Yeah. We went to Sonic and got him a strawberry sundae and I got a, what did I get? Choco Brownie Extreme from Dunk, nope. Dairy Queen. And now we're home and we're in bed and I think I want to hit in the vlog here. I'm sorry the lighting is really bad and dark right now just because we're in bed. But um, thank you so much for watching this vlog. I really hope that you did enjoy it. If you did, then go ahead and click up the like button for me and subscribe if you want to. And ding the little bell down there so you're notified every time I upload. And you guys, I'll see you in the next video. Bye!